Nothing can hold me down. Nothing can make me frown. Flying like an eagle. That's why I'm so in a shine. I shine. You're the star. That's just who you are. Shine bright like a diamond. I'm living up in the sky. I've got all it takes. I'm not giving up. I'm going straight to the top. And I'm never ever gonna lose my strength. Yeah. I was gonna make me frown. Flying like Nico. That's why I'm so in a shine. Not going down so grown, I shine, oh, I shine, yeah, yeah, yeah. I met with a lawyer today. I understand you really want me to sign those divorce papers. What? Why are you trying to make it look as if I'm a bad father to my children? I never said you were a bad father. All I want is a divorce. At this time, our daughter is sick. Isn't that selfish? Oh, please! Who is selfish here? You were not selfish when you lied about your results, your genotype results, right? Now because I'm asking for a divorce, I am selfish. I am not disputing that. All I am saying, not at this time. Our daughter is sick. All we need to do, we need to help her. That's what I'm asking for. And now you're pretending to be a perfect daddy, right? Because I need a divorce. At least it shows that I put my family first before my feelings. Oh no, you don't. Because if you did, you would not have lied about your genotype, which has put us in this mess. So... You two are getting a divorce. Who are you asking? Ask your mother. Girl. We would have told you. When, mom? When she finally dies, huh? No one is dying. Quit the pretense, mom. I know Naomi is sick. I heard you two. Was that why you sent her to the boarding house? So she wouldn't know your plans? That you two are getting a divorce? To hide the truth from Mom? I just did not want to get her emotionally destabilized. I wanted her to concentrate with her studies. Did you just say emotional destabilization? Mom, do you even know what emotional destabilization is? When well, news flash, ma, taking her away from her brother without saying goodbye, keeping her sickness away from her and getting a divorce behind her back, that is the meaning of emotional destabilization. Do you even know how she will feel when she finally finds out? Or were you magicians planning on hiding it forever? I'm so done with you too. John! Too. That's none of your business, man. Again? John. Yeah, John, what's up? I'm fine. Please, have you seen Michael? No. No. Any problem? <laughs> no. Thank you. Okay, um, why don't you just sit and let me get you something to drink? I, I he usually comes around this time. Really? Yeah, please. 
Okay. Okay. Your girlfriend. My mom actually. Wow. What a romantic way to say I love you. You can say that again. So, why are you not picking your calls? I broke up with my mom. You broke up with your mom? I know, right? You know what? Just give me a few minutes, let me think. So tell me, who breaks up with their parents? I know it sounds weird, right? Yeah. And now that you've broken up with your parents, where are you going to stay? Or oh, do you have an apartment of your own? An apartment? Nah. I, I don't. So where will you be sleeping tonight? I don't know. Really, I, I don't. Do you mind staying in my place for the night? <laughs> like seriously? Yeah, if you don't mind. It's not like I have a choice. <laughs> All right, come on, let's go. You smoke? Yeah. Wait. How long? Since when my mother died. Oh. So you have about that. It's been two years now. So tell me, no siblings? Ah, yeah. just that everyone is awesome. So tell me, do you smoke? No, I, I don't. I am, I'm too responsible. <laughs> you think I'm not responsible? Come on. After knowing you've been smoking for two years. <laughs> <laughs> That's funny. If I love you as a fairy tale. I will judge and rescue you on the fairy hero say do I like and you will say I do and if we had babies there we look like you if we saw the beautiful if they came true you don't even know how very special you are you leave me breath You're everything of my life. You leave me breathless. I still can't believe that you're mine. You just walked out of my dreams. So beautiful, you leave in me. You make the sad eyes. Then be this courage, though I realize. It's hard to pay for it in a world full of people. You can lose sight of it and the darkness inside you makes you feel so small. But I see your true colors shining through. I see your true colors and that's why I love you. So don't be afraid to let them show you. John. Mom. You're home. I'm back. Where were you last night? Good afternoon. And who is she? Mom, this is Abigail. Look, I hope you both know about your genotypes. And I hope you've not lied to her about yours either. Mom. 
Love is not all about going into his house when his parents are not at home. Excuse me. I'm, I'm, I'm sorry. I'm sorry, I'm sorry about that. Yes. Okay. Um, please, um, I have to take my leave. I believe the children are future. Teach them well and let them lead the way. Show them all the beauty that possess inside. Give them the sign of life to make it easier. Let the children love. How found the great hey, hey. love of God inside of me. We were still kids when we fell in love, not knowing what it was. I will not give you a first time. Darling, just kiss me slow. Your heart is all I own. And in your eyes, your home am I. Paul. Yes, sir. You are welcome. Thank you very much. I said for you, my daughter came to me reporting you that you want to take on a new woman as a wife. Is it true? Not really, sir. I've not concluded yet. You have not concluded it yet. Concluded what? The decision of taking another wife? I learned your daughter advised you both to go for adoption. Is it true? It has never happened before in the lineage of my family. And I won't be the first to do that. I won't just do it. I won't bring in a child that is not mine. To nurture a child that is not my own, my own blood. What will I tell my parents? I won't do it. What would I do without your smart mind? Draw me in and you kicking me out. You got my head spinning, no kidding, I can't pin you down. What's going on in that beautiful mind? I'm a your magical mystery ride. And I'm so dizzy, you know what hit me, but I feel right. My head's on the wall, so bored and breathing fine. But Paul, if I may ask, before you both got married, you knew your genotype. Is that not true? We knew about that, sir. Then why is the sudden change of mine? And in my own child. I won't just accept that adoption. I won't do it. A friend of mine had a similar problem. He adopted a baby girl. The baby is now a grown-up girl. And their love is still intact. Why don't you? Go for daughter's report or take on the daughter's report. But I don't have any problem. That is their own. But for me, I won't just bring up a child that is not mine. My son, I am giving you an advice. The doctor who gave you that advice is not a fool. Because he wants you to maintain that love, that first love. He doesn't want you to spoil your home, your family. We've come to the end of today's audition. Like you all know, we are actually looking for the uh, best tree today. And at the end of 
all the performances we on the table here have come up with the best three so if you hear your name please step forward first on the list Hannah second we have Felix and Naomi Well, for Anthony and Blessing, this is the end of the road for you on this audition. And I want you guys to go back home, keep pushing, because you know a lot of opportunities will come up. So this particular one shouldn't be a setback to you in your careers. So you have to keep on pushing, you have to try your best when next there's an opportunity like this. So thank you for coming. This is your fault. What's your problem? What's really hard for you to do? You'll be acting as king of boys, but you're a chicky chicken. Do you want to lose me? From this moment, you are the one right beside you, it's where I belong. From this moment, on. I shouldn't be the one sad. I'm talking to you. Have you done that assignment? What's wrong? What do you think is wrong with me? You look sad. What's the problem? No, me should be the one sad, not me. That's okay now. Conceal them. You're the only one who deserves to present the school. Not Naomi. Hmm? Stop being sad. Yeah? Stop being sad. Naomi, have you told me what I said? Today is Friday. Or something with it. Naomi. Just who you are
shine bright like a diamond. I'm living up in the sky. I've got all it takes. I'm not giving up. I'm going straight to the top. And I'm never ever gonna lose my strength. I'm gonna let me down. Yeah. I was gonna make me frown. Flying like an ego. That's why I'm so in a shine. I shine, I shine, I shine.